Hello and welcome back to another installment of Thursday Throwdown, the show where we pit two Golden Age sets against each other and you vote for the figures on our teams. This week, I am building out of the Dota 2 starter set and Simeon is building out of the Lone Ranger set. Simeon, why don't you tell us about your team? And, and as always, we're playing with the 2021 updated rules. We have yeah. a full rule book right now. There are some clarifications that need to be, but uh, we're just going to do our best to play with these new rules, give you guys a feel for them with these figures that were definitely not designed to have these new rules in mind. So, Simeon, take us away. Tell us about your team. Yeah. Your amazing set, team. One of the few sets that I actually own every figure of. Of course, that only being four actual figures from this set. But starting off, Team Lone Ranger is the Lone Ranger. Wow. So Ooh, thematic. Course, it's like when, sense. like when you're watching a TV show and the guy says the name of the show and you're just like, yeah, they did it. Um, <laughs> so, yeah, he's 75 points. He's got the PD team ability. But uh, according to good old Jetpack down in the comments here, the actual team ability logo. Let me adjust my glasses here on his dial is Texas Rangers. So the PDTA, the same thing. Or is this a ratted or what? Um don't know, don't care. I don't know what the Texas Rangers team ability was. I have a card somewhere, but... Eyes of the Ranger are upon you. Yeah, you just have to... Anytime right. you do a roundhouse kick, you have to like replay it five times. That's what the team ability is. Um, yeah, all, the, all those roundhouse kicks that you can do. Six, six range, double lightning bolt, sharpshooter. So not only can I shoot out of adjacency, I can double target punch out of adjacency. Uh, energy shield and shape change top dial. Uh, he, some guy, let's see, Swarmer80 says he's probably quite good, but he's so boring I can't actually think about him. Well, I wish that was true for me as well, but uh, here we are. Um, next up is Tonto. Oh, I forgot. The most important part about these is they had the terrible tab app sculpts, which were like bobblehead is bobblehead they are huge. looking things, just ginormous heads and tiny like normal Heroclix bodies. It's weird to think of all the Disney properties we could have gotten. We got one off of the 2013 <laughs> Lone Ranger movie. <laughs> yes. Uh, so next up, Tonto. That'd be a good Sting custom. Except wait, Brainiac. Ugh. For the win says Apache Chief mod anyone. Well, sadly, Brainiac for the win only had to wait two years to get an actual Apache Chief instead of Tonto here. Um, he's got perplex top dial, super senses charge, just a close combat piece. He does get energy explosion on his back end with his four range. Um, he's got enhancement on the bottom end, which is so great after you spend your entire time getting close and attacking your opponent to have enhancement just really good character design there uh exploit that with blaze is great. Energy explosion yeah yeah well um, to be fair with how the movie went i believe it's probably called dynamite it's called nitro so yeah, yeah. for how the movie went they do blow up a train near the end so I do that's pretty accurate out, uh, for, Tonto. For, for 50 points swarmer 80 says good piece too good actually tab app sculpts are uglier than sin though so too good yeah, he's we, too good for a 10 attack a... one damage no blades top <laughs> dial he's too good we could have seen a tonto meta needs nerf now had it not been for the tab app sculpts no one would play him because of that but he was too right. good at the that's time that's the only reason that's the only reason speaking of terrible dials here's butch cavendish um yep that's what he looks like a hairy thumb with a hat very cool uh, he starts off with Flurry, love that, and then immediately goes to Running Shot, comboed with some Steel Energy. What is going on, Butch Cavendish? What are you doing? None of this makes sense to me. Why um, not? Somebody says he should really have the Cavendish gang as a keyword. And then uh, good old Thomas5 with the Nothing Doug's Army and Hammer Can't Cure. <laughs> Wow, I, I mean, uh, the Doug's Army, this is a 2014 What's... reference, but I'm surprised, you know, uh, Doug's Army doesn't get brought up very often in HC Realms, so that's great. Um, 
Never happens. Yeah, Never just happens. super wonky dial, 75 points, six range. That's Butch Cavendish. Then we've got uh, Red Harrington. Yep. Very sultry looking lady there. Oh, she's hot. Hot. <laughs> Third head that's twice the size of her torso. Just how I like them. Um, that's the way I like them. We've got the uh, <laughs> mind control end cap duo up top with some perplex. We have some outwit bottom dial. Um, Guess what her mind control If she is gets hit and she dies. Guess what her mind control super is called senses. What's that? Her, her mind control is called Feminine Wiles. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Just like the uh, the Star Trek ladies. The uh, Her, her incapacity is uh, pay attention to me, boys. I have the real life cards in front of me. Uh, her her outwit is it takes a smart woman to survive in a man's world. Her perplex oh, yeah, is not yeah. just another pretty face. Look at that face. That's not just another pretty face, Simeon. I would describe this face many ways, but not just another pretty face is a pretty good way to describe it. Because if anything, it's Ooh. definitely not Ooh. another pretty face. Um, That's right. <laughs> That's uh, right. I'm going to try and read this. Blink Von Blink. No, oh, Bink Von Binky says, if she gets hit, she dies, but super senses with incapacitate and perplex made her pretty solid for 50 points. I was using six of her in a game and one because of those three abilities. Why were you using six? What were you doing? <laughs> what? <laughs> if, wow. she get, if she gets Just hit, wow. she dies. But super senses with incapacitate and perplex that is true she does have those three powers made her pretty solid for 50 yeah, points four range though i was using six four of her, range but yeah you could make that a seven range with six of her you're thinking man he must have been playing against awesome. somebody with an awful team or someone who had just started and he probably lied to that poor kid <laughs> like uh, like like come on 2013 this yeah. is back when feedback damage from my control was a thing what is yeah. this guy on anyways just... we've talked much too long about simian's characters and no powers yeah these very interesting characters um and then last but not least is outlaw bystander from the mini game for the lone ranger um and i'll just yeah stealth and in cap with an eight attack one damage five range 12 points and Xenon648 says it really good. This set is so bad. So, yeah, that's that's the last of my yeah. team. I had to double up with Red Harrington. So I've only got two. No way I'm going to win with just two instead of six. But I do have two Tontos as well. So we'll see. Yeah, there's a lot of perplex in your team. If only you could up your damage. Yes. Uh, first up, I got Tide Hunter. I don't know anything about these Dota guys. I'm a Team Fortress 2 person, but this is a Valve property. Uh, the Dota game itself, fun fact, came with, well, the Dota starter came with a coupon, a Steam code for Dota 2 in Steam. Uh, when you unlocked it, you actually got a uh, physical like thing in your backpack, and then you could click on it to then unlock Dota for your library. So people would sell the dota 2 code from their backpack on the steam community market for 40 dollars actually so it would pay for the cost wow. of this starter which is pretty cool so that's a little fun fact for you there so if anyone has a starter by the way the dota 2 it, dota 2 is free now so that's probably worth like three cents for just people that just sort of want to own it type of deal but uh, that's just a little fun fact but if anybody has a dota 2 starter like complete with map or anything i am looking for one anyway we have tide hunter here he's uh, he's got ravage special attack power on some of his clicks, I guess. He can use incapacitate as a double power action to make a close combat attack, targeting all opposing characters within four squares on the same elevation level as Tidehunter. Uh, hit characters can't ignore pushing damage during this action. Uh, fun fact, it is not within line of fire. It's a close attack, so it's great. And, and uh, they, they can ignore pushing damage. Pushing damage, of course, um, isn't a thing anymore uh, in the new rules. So that never does dare for ignore him. pushing damage nowadays. Uh, imagine yep. getting caught. Yep. Wouldn't even think about pushing it. Pushing damage during a tournament, you'd get you'd get kicked yeah. out and heckled. Yeah. Kicked Ugh. out. Uh, how could you? So on clicks five, six, and nine, he has gush. <laughs> so random. He can use pen blast and sharpshooter ability as if he had a range of four. 
he gets one whole extra range when he's got gush. Otherwise, he only has three range. He does have dolphin speed symbol, which is pretty good. Yeah. Um, and he's got some producers. He's he's got those. But yeah, that's Tide Hunter. Next up is the Faceless Void, aka my mother-in-law. But um, that's like boomer jokes, right? It's funny. Yeah. Anyways, uh, he's hundred and twenty-five points for charge, eleven attack, two damage. With a 17 super, can't even start with an 18 super senses. Yeah, 17 super senses. He has a epic action. Once per game, give him an epic action, and all opposing characters in four squares are given two action tokens. Placement of these action tokens does not cause pushing damage. After resolutions of this action, remove all action tokens from faces void. So thankfully, this one doesn't deal pushing damage. Not that you would have to worry about that, anyways. <laughs> but still, um. Man, Dota is just all about actioning up your opponent. And then he's got another trait called Time Lock. Whenever Faceless Void hits an opposing character with an attack, roll a d6. On the result of a 6, give that character an action token. So it's any time he hits an opposing character with an attack, which is good, but it is only on a 6, which is fine. I guess he's using it all the time. Uh, and then next is Razor. Razor here has also an epic action, which is the whole power action. Uh, he makes a ranged combat attack, targeting the opposing character on the highest click number within range. It does not say line of fire, just within range. For this attack, modify Razor's attack and damage value plus one for each action token assigned to the target, which is pretty cool. Uh, it's not once per game either, so he does have a potential for doing quite a bit of damage for his attack and damage values by plus one. If the character's got two tokens, he can be a 12 for four top dial. He can actually be a 12 for 4, quite a bit of the dial, or an 11 for 4, which is pretty solid. He also has another treat, which is he can use Pulse Wave. When he does, friendly characters are not affected by this use of Pulse Wave, which is actually really good. Give this guy the Goblin Glider. Yeah. And about a million other things to make him playable. Uh, and then he's got a special defense on some clicks where he has Mystic's team ability, which is pretty good, actually. It's not terrible. So, um weird. He can't just have that the whole time, but he is super vanilla starting out. He's very ranged-based. Um, but he does have a, you know, his bottom die is full of steel energy to heal back up to full, which is nice, I guess. Uh, pretty cool sculpts. All these Dota figures are good. Yeah. He's not actually ice based, apparently, even though it looks like ice. This is the next guy is ice based. Turns out, I guess. Uh, so yeah, it brings us to Lich. Lich, who, uh, that doesn't look ice based, but I guess he is. Yeah. He looks pretty cool. Undead cold wizard man. Yeah. Like the ice king. Ooh, he's got Chain Frost. Give Lich a ranged combat action as if he had four targets, which is pretty gnarly. Uh, after actions resolve, he may make another ranged combat attack targeting up to three opposing characters that were not hit by the first attack, but are within three squares and line of fire of a hit target. All hit characters from these attacks are dealt one penetrating damage and are given an action token. That's actually like really, really good, but he only has it on clicks two and five, which sucks. And of course, with not being able to just push him to those clicks... It's like, man, I don't know if this will ever happen. But yeah, it is a really, it's actually a really good power. Um, then he has ice armor on some of his clicks. Uh, give Lich power action. Choose from the character within three squares and line of fire. Until the beginning of your next turn, a chosen character can use, yay, toughness. And any opposing character that attacks a chosen character with a close combat attack is given an action token after action is resolved, which is actually kind of cool, um, I guess. But yeah, so he can he can sort of add buffs to other people, not himself. Um He's a support class. What can we say? But we built 400 points, which means we have four actions. I don't think either of our teams have leadership, the coveted power of leadership. We were playing on the Dota map because that's, I believe, the only map that any of these sets have, unless the fun little starter game for whatever. Uh, I almost said Winter Soldier, but it's <laughs> Lone Ranger. Uh, unless the fun starter Lone Ranger had like a super small map, we're going to be playing on the Jai Humongous Dota map for right now in Simeon. One map roll because he's got a past theme team, so he's got theme yeah. props and all sorts of jazz. Which Plus is wild. three so, roll. Why so would you? I, uh, I only beat Calder's roll by ahead. one, um, and I technically do have yeah three theme team props. So, um, yeah. So I get to pick the four people I want to move out. So it's definitely going to be Lone Ranger, A Tonto. Um, might as well move out the Butch Ca Cavendish and a red harrington so mm. we'll just one of each will be fine 
Boy, this map is five, six, seven. Yeah. This map is, uh, I, I mean, it's cool. It's just with only boot symbol, it's kind of strange. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. A good old aptly named Butch Boy here. Um, let's see. I'm going to move a Red Harrington. I'll move this back one. It's six squares. We'll go there. We'll get my army hammer out and about. Let's see, he's got nine speed. He's gonna go there. And uh, we'll move a Tonto an amount of speed. Also nine, so he'll go Yeah. Mm. That seems cool. Good Lone Ranger and Tonto. Um Yeah, we'll do uh we'll have uh Tonto perplex up his own defense and Ms. Scarlet here will perplex up Butch Cavendish's defense. Because let's see. Ah uh, yes, he's got mastermind, hmm. so I'll be wanting to keep him top dial. Of course, his flurry close combat expert being his most powerful part of his dial. I will not want to get him off of that. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and move um what's his face? Tide Hunter eight squares to here. And then Let's have this uh, this lich guy can move a whole six squares to there, and then good old oh, what's his face? I don't remember faceless void? What's his face? It's funny. One, two, three. Let's gonna move ten squares to there, and then and then last but certainly not least, we got razor. Can move a big seven squares. Razor. And uh and yeah, it's your turn. It's your turn, Simeon. Blazer. Um good old Johnny D here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I wanna say these guys have probably should have double checked this before I No, it is uh stealth bottom dial, not top dial. In fact, no one on my team has stealth top dial mm -hmm. except for the outlaws. Okay. So uh, Johnny D and Jack with Sparrow Hat, it, they're both going to perplex up their own defenses. Uh, we'll move him there. Uh, Ms. Scarlet, number two. Should probably mm -hmm. move out six squares. Uh, let's go one, two, three, four. Four, five, six. <laughs> what a terrible location I just put that person in. <laughs> I just realized the entire brim is blocking, so there's absolutely no line of fire being drawn up there. Um, yep. She yeah, will it's amazing. Throw her perplex into uh, this this Tonto. Yeah, so he's double perplexed. Uh, mm. And then we'll move two of the outlaws. We'll go at the bottom two. And they've got a whole five speed, I believe. Five speed with stealth. Wow. That was... That was some good play action there. Um, I will clear everyone with a red token. Yes. Yes, of course. <laughs> That'll be Calder's turn. Uh, wow. Wow, 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 wow. This map is uh, No leaderships huge. to roll. It, it is. It is. And yet, we're going to do a bunch of fighting right, right here in the middle. 
I don't want to take away from like the amazing, just weird things going on. Like whatever this is there. That's neat. I sure do like chunks of elevated. I sure do like these steps. They go two to one to back to two to three all in a row. It's pretty funny. That's pretty great. Uh, yeah. The fact that this is like a little little river going through. That's cute. It's fun. It's a neat. This is a neat map. I don't get the outsides. Don't really get why that's all the way it is, but it's neat. Sure is cool. Like we're in some kind of arena. So it's, I don't know. I like it. All right. Well, these Johnny D's both have their defense up by one. Which one only has it up by two? The top one. That's the two. That's the uh, double guy. Two. All right. And this one is only up by one. Yeah. Well, we're going to charge five to here. Uh, I ignore. I believe water is not. Does yeah. not stop me anymore. Is that correct? Yeah. Yeah. It's just hindering now. Sure. So. so yeah, we'll just we'll go there. Uh, it's eleven to what eighteen. Uh, yes, eighteen with senses. Yeah. Let's uh, let's go for it. Let's uh, swing. Oh, baby, it's pretty good. It's pretty good. We'll see. We'll oh, see what Simeon senses say. A full. Ooh, three damage. So good old good old faceless void. AKA not Garen. Uh my old League of Legends main. Because I played League of Legends for about maybe an hour. Um oh three damage. Excuse me, two damage. How could I? This 125 point character only has a two <laughs> damage. How could I silly me? Uh but I do get to see if I can give you an action token on a six. <laughs> hey! All right, cool. I mean, I'll take it. That's pretty sweet. That's pretty awesome. That's like the best. That's the best case scenario. Hmm. So now Tonto's on big click three. He can't retaliate anymore, which is great, which is awesome. Cool. Um, yeah, I'm going to clear the rest of these idiots. Yeah, I'll, I'll actually, I'll move Tide Hunter there, I guess. I don't know. Sure. The rest of them clear, though. Hmm. Here you go, Simeon. Here you go. That was, uh, that was pretty good. Tonto's got some pretty stealth good. combat reflexes now. And I have an unlocked the enhancement ability with mm. him. So now I will be able to add damage to my range-based team. Uh, he should only he should only be on click three. He shouldn't be on click four. I only actually dealt two damage. Yeah. Oh, wait, I didn't actually deal three. Four. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. I was still, thinking. you know, still got blades, though. Blades. Uh, it doesn't blades have stealth, exploit. but it's yeah, got blades. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's pretty good. Not terrible. Um, I had a defense reducer. Pretty good. Man, let's. You know, I'm putting a lot of faith in. Uh... Putting a lot of faith in old Bink von Binky, who won a game with six Scarlets, uh, Miss Scarlets. So I'm gonna, that's wild. That's I'm gonna wild. make her my my go to heavy hitter here. We're going to get on to this weird elevation. From here, I can see that. Whatever that is. Uh, but from here, I can She's see... She's got to be four range, right? Yeah. Uh, no, that's so, not... So, yeah. Not we'll, worse. We'll go down here. I might make her go for a swim in a bit. Um... Tide Hunter, of course, being Dolphin means I have to be within four to make an attack against him. Um, let's start. So that's action action one with Miss Scarlet there. Let's move my other Amigos. So that'll be actions two and three. Go one, two, three, four, and five squares with those guys. They're really going to be integral to this team synergy I've got going on. Uh, let's see. Good old Johnny Depp here. Without being able to increase his damage, he's pretty much stuck at a 10 for 1 his whole dial until Calder knocks him off of it. So he is going to be support piece, and that's about it. Uh he will perplex up the Lone Ranger's attack to a 12, though. The Lone Ranger mm. running shot. One, two, three, four to here. 
using my sharpshooter team ability to shoot out of adjacency. Oh, uh, okay. I will okay. dual target uh, those two guys. Tide Hunter and was that Faceless? Yeah, Void you are indeed within is... four. Okay. Yes, Tide Hunter and Faceless Faceless Void. If only, if only I had plus one defense, that would be really good. But uh, no, instead you can't target me within four squares. But you are within four squares. Ironic, but here we are. All right, I've got, I've got a twelve. Yeah, twelve for three. Seventeens. All right, that'll that'll definitely hit. Both. Ooh, that will that will hit. Uh, uh, we'll go ahead. We're gonna roll super senses with Faceless Void. He gets oh. it, so all three's gotta go. To Tide Hunter, he'll go to click three. Mm -hmm. I think as mm -hmm. let's see. Oh, that was action four. Never mind. Um, this Miss Scarlet up here will perplex up Butch Boy's defense, and good old mm -hmm. Butch Cavendish will remain unimportant for this game. Uh, this guy perplexed. The Johnny next to you has, uh, yeah, he will clear. All right. All right. I'm gonna I'm gonna move my lich to here. Oh, whatever. And then let's move Razor. Big seven squares. I don't know. One, two, three. I'll move him there. And then I'm going to clear not Garen, and then I'm going to clear not Tom Kench. It's probably not Tom. It's probably Tam or Tomb or something, but I'm going to pronounce it as Tom. It looks like Tom. All right, Simeon. That's it. That's all I got for right now. All right. For now, anyways. For now. Let's get my other red lady up here. Where she can be a real threat. Yeah, we'll just throw her to the wolves over here. Uh, she will perplex up her own defense, which right. is super senses. Um, I think Jack with Sparrow Hat will perplex up her defense as well. And... Good old Johnny D down here will attempt to Blades Exploit. Mm. On click three, he's a nine for one damage with Exploit, so he's going to attempt to Blades Exploit on Faceless Void. Okay. Okay. Uh, do you have a 14 defense? Mm. I, I actually have a 17 defense, believe it or not. Uh, I choose not to. That hits. Um... One two <laughs> would have made you feel bad if you would have missed, so that's fair. Butch, <laughs> yeah, feels bad. Uh, seven, I could get down into the water. Could go two, three, four, five, six, seven to up there. We'll do that. We'll provide backup for this lady. Say behind every. Uh, Strong Ms. Scarlet or Red Fish um, is a a Butch Boy, <laughs> Butch Cavendish. I can never remember his last name. <laughs> Butch Cavendish, yeah. Um, Cavendish. Harring, Harrington just makes me think of Herring with an E, and so it just makes me think like oh, the, the fish. Red Fish Lady. Yeah. So I'm just like Red mm. Fish Lady. Um, Let's see. That's one, two, three. Good old army hammer is going to attempt to pew pew. He's going to shoot at uh, faceless void and tide hunter again with an 11 for three. All right. Sounds good. Does a 16 possibly hit anything? A 16 will, will luckily miss both of them, actually. Mm. I did not move any amigos this turn, so I will clear all of them. All right. All right. And uh, let's uh, let's go ahead. 
Oh yeah. Let's see if old uh, old faceless void can take a swing on Army Hammer here. He's got shape change for some reason. Secret identity. He's got a oh, mask. No. You All saw right. past my mask. <laughs> Ooh, uh, does a 16 hit? Oh, you know it does, because I've got that 16 <laughs> ESD. That'll do you a whole two damage there, Simeon. And then I'll see if I can give you an action token. Wow, ah, failed. Luckily for me, a third action token, as you know, does nothing. So that was... <laughs> Very lucky for me. It's true. Let's have Tidehunter go ahead and shoot. Uh, good old the Lone Ranger here. Tidehunter, however, still, he's actually still 10 attacks. That's it's pretty good. Ooh, does a 17 hit? That will hit my 16 combat reflexes. <laughs> That'll deal a whole 3 damage from old Tidehunter here. Oh, no. The namesake of this property, Army Hammer, has been uh, KO'd without mercy. He did get two shots off, though. Most of them didn't hit, but... Let's, uh... I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna Razor do their epic action here. Uh, that's gonna be target an opposing character uh, on the highest click number. Within, within range. I'm going to say that's Miss Scarlet. She's on click one. This Miss Scarlet right here. Modify my attack and damage value plus one for each action token. So he'll be an 11 for three against Miss Scarlet. Seeing if we can... Ooh, baby. That should definitely hit. It's uh, hitting a 20. Most likely does. But I do have super senses. It's a red power for a red mm. lady. Ah, it fails. Ah. Ah, well, as... Uh... Bink Von Binky says, if she gets hit, she dies. So I must abide by Bink Von Binky's rules. <laughs> how, how much damage are you dealing her? That's three damage. Okay. She will go to click four. I guess. And Bink not Von, die. Whoa. Bink Von Binky lied to me. All right. Uh, I guess we will now have the Lich take a shot at her. Um, can use range coming since he has four targets. Does having four targets help me at all? Oh, he doesn't have that power. What am I saying? He doesn't have his cool chain power. He's just gonna shoot her. All right. Oh boy. Uh, does a 13 hit? I assume no. No, that will Probably miss not. by three whole, uh, I don't know, numerical values. Oh, uh, Miss, Miss Scarlet. Yeah. All right. Well, that's it. That's, that's my turn. <laughs> yep that's what that's Ooh. what we got now my miss scarlets will really show you what is going on um so fun fact what is going on, mind so control you? is minimum six range now and with my one whole target i can target somebody uh let's see are you you're on elevation two? Okay, that's very confusing. But yes, you are on yeah, elevation two. It is. Um and I haven't hit faceless void yet, is that right? He's still on click one. Yeah, you can you can do faceless void. Ugh. You could do uh do like Lich. The problem with mind control in this sense is your guys are almost worse than mine, so it's almost a waste <laughs> of an action. <laughs> To even bother. Um, Huzzah! <laughs> you true. could in cap me down, but there's no pushing damage anymore, which is real rough. Otherwise, it's a pretty valid tactic you could have had. Let's. You still, you still pass, still like past probs, so I wouldn't, I wouldn't feel too bad here. Let's outwit Fisher enhancements. Void's defense. Oh, that's rough. Start with that's that. rough. Okay, no senses for faceless void. He's just got his his stock seventeen. And then we'll have, that's all he's got. We'll have Tonto here. Ah, that's all he's got. With his nine attack, he'll attempt to blades the faceless void. So, all right. A 
Ooh, seven. that will hit. That is the magic number you needed to hit. Yeah. We will blades you four. Five whole damage. Here we go. Ooh, wow, Dean. that's pretty that's pretty good. Master of the blades. Um, taking faceless void to click six. Click six, aka. Nope, still alive, I guess. No, oh, flurry with an eight attack, one damage though on the on the faceless void. Amazing. Let's see. Amazing. That is an action for Johnny here. Which Could probably zoom in a little bit on the game there, a little, a little closer. Yeah, since we're not using the there we go. of the map. Yeah, we're not using a lot of the map. We will have good old Butch Cavendish. I want to say Cassidy, because that was the real person, but... Um... No, it's not right. <laughs> Let's see, one, two, three... Four, five, six, seven. Let's do that. Cavendish coming at you. Yeah. Ooh. Uh, he'll go there. Okay. 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 Uh, All right. We will have Ms. Scarlet perplex up his defense because elevation is weird in this map. And I think that I can see down there, but. No, I can't because there's another. I can do no. Yeah, literally. Yeah, there's another thing of two. He's on one. Um, yeah. Very strange. Uh, let's see. I will just have my Jack with Sparrow hat charge. Well, let's go one, two, three to here. And he will attempt to, I guess, punch you for one damage because I can't perplex it up. Um, on Razor or on Faceless uh, Void? We'll be going against Faceless Void. Faceless Void. He's got a 16 defense. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. Ah. Let's see. Ooh. My attack value is a 10. Does a 13 hit? Oh, that will, that will miss. That will uh, miss by a little Just a little bit. Just a little bit. Well, we do have my mind control left. What's good old Faceless Void's speed value here? It's like eight. It is eight. It's got eight speed, eight attack, one damage. Wow. Let's wow, wow, wow. Wow, wow. Wow, wow. Wow, wow. We will attempt the mind control. 10 into a 16. Ah, good. That's... Well, That's, hey, you know, at least you don't take any damage. I guess I do have I do have past theme team probs, so I'm going to theme team prob this. You do also have that. That is true. A 16. That will hit. That's the magic number that you need it to get. All right. Let's successfully mind control the faceless boy. Faceless One, boy. Two, three, four. We'll move him over here. And I don't have enough actions to attack with my my outlaws, but uh, maybe next turn. And everyone has to just stay. Let's see, one, two, three, four. Yeah, those four all attacked. So just the top Miss Scarlet clears. Hmm. All right. Well, there's only one. There's a few people I can do actions with. Uh, I'm not liking where my void is for right now. It's not he's not in love with where he's at, but faceless void does <laughs> have an epic action. Uh or we can choose all posting characters in four squares or giving up to two action tokens. Uh placements of these tokens do not cost pushing damage. After resolutions, I remove all action tokens face void. So we're going to power action, faceless void to do that. It's not within line of fire or anything. So anyone within four. AKA, I'll give all these guys two action tokens. Then after actions resolve, clear my action tokens, which is actually uh, pretty good power. It's pretty solid. Yeah. Yeah. Because you could and all just keep doing four squares that, given like, two action tokens. Yeah. You could use. Yeah. Potentially, I mean, he's a lot of points, but you potentially you could just lock up a whole team if they positioned wrong. Right. That's going to be my way of. 
you know, whatever. In capping, double tokening all of the quadruple amigos and Tad. Don't know. I don't get the Tad one, but he well, is there. Yeah. So they all get action tokens, which is pretty cool. Um, and then let's have Tide Hunter. He'll just try to shoot. Uh, oh, no, he can't shoot anybody. He's got to punch Butch Cavendish. So I guess he'll punch Butch Cavendish. Give those guys action tokens. Simeon, what are you waiting for? It takes too long. It's. Uh, uh, let's see. Uh, All right. Punching. Uh, what's Butch Cavendish got, huh? He's got Mastermind. Well, it's not really in a good spot to use it. So let's go ahead. Roll two dice. Ooh. With knockback. Tide Hunter. Butch Cavendish. What do you have? You had Ravage? Well, Ravage wouldn't have been good. So, yeah, we'll just deal three damage with Tide Hunter. One, two and three. Ah. The beloved power combo of running shot steel energy on click four here. And then we're going to clear our other people. One, two, three. One, two, three. Yeah, technically, your knockback movement would have been stopped, but. Uh... Never mind. Doesn't matter. It's not part of the rules. So go yeah. ahead, Simeon. Here we go. It's locked yeah. in three yeah. knock for all knockback, unless it specifies otherwise. That is true. And then it doesn't deal damage, but why does it? Getting thrown into walls doesn't hurt anybody. Yeah. Um, of course not. Why would it? That makes no sense. What's what's uh what's this guy? What's uh Mr. Mr. What's Razor. What, yeah. What's he got for defensively? Razor? <laughs> you know Razor's got a 16 with nothing. Uh, okay, good, good. You know he does. Uh, let's see. One, right. Two, of course. Three, four. Of course. Man. Oh, just one out of my range. Dang. Oh. Darn. So Rats. So foiled. Shoot. By this, this bummer. Team. Uh I could perplex up her range. Never. Except I don't you can't perplex up a minimum, so that's not even a thing that I'm I'm just making things up at this point. Uh we'll have this Miss Scarlet move. One, two, three to here. We will have mm. This bottomist here, Tonto, charge one, two, three, four to here. A ten into good old faceless void. Oh no. A fourteen. Mm. Uh, he will flex up his own defense. And this lady will outwit. Uh the liches something um what's he got ice armor and he's got in cap and he's got his ice armor power yeah we'll we'll get rid of his in cap that's a pretty stout okay uh, yep sure she will, sure is she'll move one square nice and i will nice. clear all the outlaws nice. I will clear Johnny D and Butch Cavendish. Well, with uh, with faceless voids, you know, I think ah, geez, it feels like it's just the best to just keep doing that power action. So all these outlaws don't just rip me to shreds. Ah, what do they got? Uh, I got eight attacks. I got it nineteens. Uh, he's only got to hit nineteen twice though. Try to get rid of Tonto here. Yeah, we'll worry about that later. First of all, we got we got Razor. And Razor can either do their, their ranged combat attack, target somebody, um, but they really can't. Oh, we're in a bad spot right now. Razor can actually uh, can single target pulse wave Butch Cavendish. So I think that's what's what Razor is gonna do. So uh so yeah, let's do that. Ten to stuff. That'll hit 20s for two whole damage. Dang, Butch Cavendish. Of Actually, course, that pulse wave will ignore friendly characters. 
which is yeah. nice. Actually, that's uh, what with, with our new PAC <laughs> rules, uh, Pulse Wave. In oh, it does one damage. Excuse me. One. Yeah. Yes. Uh, Only one damage. Yeah, that's right. That is correct. Correct. I'm going to click five though. Oh, let's see. Mister Mister Lich is gonna try to take a shot at the Miss Scarlet without wit. See if he can get rid of her. Ooh, that will that will hit. Uh, let's see her defense on click four is a nothing she is mm. potentially too good if only it wasn't for those tab right app sculpts she is a game winning piece <laughs> notably we're gonna we're gonna have faceless void try to try to flurry jack with sparrow hats we'll see if faceless void can get some flurries off um that will actually hit that would hit an 18. Let's wow, see. very surprised. I, I think that's the yeah, that's the one that still has super senses. So I still have a shot to Yeah, he does. survive this. Evade, yeah. No. Okay. Let me read how faceless void works. This is uh when he hits an opposed character with an attack, roll d6. So I'm just gonna I hit you with an attack, so I'm gonna roll d6. Nope, okay. Second attack. That will hit 15s. Which I doubt, I doubt uh, you have. I'm, I'm an 18 right now. Uh, click well, two. all right. Well, what what did your first attack hit me to? Oh, uh, when it hits you to click two, it's only you only got one okay. damage. You yeah. only got the one so singular be, damage. Then we'll clear Tide Hunter. 18 on that one. Say it's your go there, Simeon. All right. Getting rid of my perplex. I see. Interesting. Uh, let's see. Mm -hmm. Good old Butch Cavendish no longer has running shot. None of his good combos, but I, st I do still have steel energy. So let's just move right back over. Well, yeah, we'll move right back over to here. And we'll, we'll hope that you miss. That's what we'll do. Uh, Amigos is going to take a shot at Faceless Void. Now, he's got uh, an 8 for 1, and then it'll add an action token to you if he hits. That'll hit 13s. Ooh. Very lucky. Very lucky. And then uh, Tad, the lesser known of the quadruple amigos, will also attempt to punch with a, a bullet and it'll add an action token if he hits <laughs> I'll just miss that'll, yeah, hit, I'll just miss hit 15s so it'll miss by one let's see that's one mm. two three my Johnny D down here with his three click three he is Still charge, but just barely. So he's going to attempt to charge somebody. I think we're just, yeah, we're just going to try and get rid of this faceless void here. So he's going to charge with his nine attack. Exploit weakness, blades. Uh, that, that'll hit 19s. That will, which means it's a big super senses roll to see the faceless void. Makes that alive. He does not. First, first death for Team Dota. Faceless oh, Void damn, is gone. Uh, Into the void see. he goes. One, two, three, and four. I will clear Johnny with Sparrow Hat, and Ms. Scarlet will also clear. Uh, I think she's still got Perplex, so she'll Perplex up her own defense, and we'll call that good. Hmm. Hmm. All right. Well, we're going to have old Tide Hunter here. Actually, no, we're not. Let's have uh, who's on top there. That's the Lich. Let's have this Lich take a shot on Butch Cavendish. Try to take him out. Ooh, does, a, does a 20 hit? I would imagine damage. so, yeah. yeah. Uh, for two damage, I do have <laughs> Toughness. 
So I'll put Ooh, that down all right. to one damage. And I'll go to click six. Butch Cavendish is a pretty mm. tough guy. He's at least well, six. We tried. Away. We tried. I guess now we're gonna have Tide Hunter try to try to take care of him. Ten attack on Tide Hunter. Ooh, wow! Of course, it's an eighteen hit. Uh, you needed a fifteen, so no, you'll miss by three. Of course, my special ah, power of course, my bad. Requiring you to hit exactly my defense value. Uh, if only, if only uh, I was on Doug's army with a hammer. Butch Cavendish might have been really solid, according to some people. According to literally one person, Thomas Five. Yeah. Hmm. All right. Well, now I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to move this guy one, two, three, four to here. And I'm going to end my turn. Wow. Wow. All right. It's time for me to stop playing nice here. I'm going to move these two outlaws. One. Two, three, four, five. Yeah, something like that. Mm. Oh, oh, we're on blue. The and quadruple are now in stealth, as they should be. Uh, good for mm. them. Very proud of them. Uh, let's charge blades with exploit to here targeting razor all right We've got a, a solid nine attack still so far tonto has been the only one to deal damage an 18 oh that will hit absolutely oh absolutely hit yeah all right let's see for what five Good. Jeez, that was good. That was good. But, take me to click. Take me to click six. In a set. Wow. Wow! Wow! Zero wow! Ability to increase damage. Wow. The two bed. Very good. It was very good. Wow! Wow! <laughs> wow! Jeez. Yeah, that's rough. Let's. Uh, that is uh, rough. Let's see. That's three. Let's perplex down his defense with Miss Scarlet, and we'll charge with my Johnny D, who will also attempt to blaze. Mm. I believe Johnny D is, uh, yeah, he's on click three and click one. No, click three and click two. Yeah, so same exact stats. That'll hit a 19. Oh, defense down. Need a 16 to hit. Ooh, that will hit. That will hit. Absolutely. We will deal. Oh, boy. Six damage. Something low. Oh, God. Good Lord. Holy shit. <laughs> All right. That will kill. Uh, that will kill Razor. You'll one turn Razor just like that. Yikes. Uh, so much for ever landing on his Mystic's power or trying to pulse wave the whole team. <laughs> that's, 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 that's Razor. That's that's him. Uh, Yikes, man! What, Yikes! What was the Jeez. See, swarmer eighty said? Good piece, too good actually. Tab app sculpts are uglier than sin, though. So yeah, the the Tonto Meadow He's too good. was He's very too much. Good. A real thing. Uh, I'm gonna clear <laughs> amigos and Tad. My outlaws back here. <sighs> Wow, this this is uh this is rough. We're gonna we're gonna move up. We're gonna move up Tide Hunter. One, two. Four to there. Uh we're gonna clear the lich. And <laughs> see your go, I guess. Jeez. Oof. See if I can Oof. I think all all three of my blades rolls have been fives or higher. It's been five, five, and six. Fives and sixes, yeah, that's so we're going to try and keep it going. Tonto uh, is real good with that tomahawk is what his blades are. Makes sense. The tomahawk, yeah. Um, 
Let's see. We'll perplex down Tidehunter's defense and mm. attempt yeah, of course, to mine of course you would. with Miss Scarlet. Oh, all right. Okay, okay. You can have a 16 defense. No, that will hit. That will hit poor Tidehunter. Yes. Yeah, That's a bummer. Um, let's see. So he's got three range. Yeah, he's going to shoot mm. at the Lich. All right. Oh, okay. I assume that. Yeah, that will miss. luckily miss. Uh, that will, yeah. The Lich has a whole 16 for defense. And then we'll move him up to half of his speed value, and that'll be. Let's see. One, two. Yeah, it's eight. Three so it's four. We're going we're gonna to move him right there. And then good old mm. Tonto here. Okay has this power combo called Blades Exploit he's going to try and do. This is going well, to be bad. That'll be a nice I already don't like it. Fudge, man! Jeez! You are all six, two, or something ridiculous. We'll see. Uh, uh, only for two. Oh, uh, two. I really, I just okay. truly thought my Tontos were just going to go crazy. If you would have rolled another six, I might have went a little Roger Stone on you there. Uh, take him a quick five. <laughs> Uh, I get knocked back. One, two, three squares. Of course. Let's see, that's one, two actions. Good old amigos here <laughs> will attempt to shoot. Uh, what's your What's your defense value now? Uh, I've only got a tough. I only got a toughness now. Seventeen tough. Toughness. I'll okay. Click five. So I can potentially give you an action token or crit hit and deal you a damage. mm Hmm. That'll do neither. That's a 14. Mm. And uh, good old quadruple down here will also attempt to shoot. Ah, uh, yes, of course. And that'll be a 15. So I will clear... Uh, that will somehow miss. The... I will clear Johnny D. And that is my turn. All right. Well, I'm going to go ahead and have the Lich here take a shot on Miss Scarlet. Ooh, 17 mm. with the Lich. Well, if she get hits, she dies, but she does have super senses. So let's, let's see here. Zero for zero on my super sense rolls. Oh. Actually, it's like zero for... Oh, five, deal whole two, whole two damage. Going to click three, and then we're gonna we're gonna clear clear Tide Hunter here. All right, what is? And it's your go. It's Tide all Hunter I got. Toughness. It's got that seventeen toughness. Oh, let's see, ladies and gents, seventeen tough. Let's uh, charge in with Johnny D. He'll go to here. Mm. Not a fan. Not a fan. I think he has this power combination called blades. Exploit. Ah, still not a fan. Uh, that'll hit thirteen. Oh, I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that. Uh, Miss okay. Scarlet, it's fine by me. Will attempt to. She will perplex down the Lich's defense and attempt uh, to mind control. Him. She does not have perplex. However, oh, that's right. She has outwit. She, however, does not. Yeah, yeah. She will outwit. You ain't got no powers. Your defense. And shoot at you with her mm. four range. How could you? <laughs> yes, that's her leg gun thing. Will a ah that will that will miss. however miss. Oh, okay, that will miss by three somehow. Amaze, amazing! What a riveting game this is. <laughs> wow, 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 wow. You either need wow. high numbers. Wow. Uh, let's clear the amigos, and we'll clear quadruple. Since one damage turns out will not help me in this game. Mm. Yes, we're gonna have Tide Hunter. He is going to to gush. He's gonna gush because he's got penetrating second blast and the sharpshooter ability, which uh -oh. means it's gonna be a nine to your sixteen. No combat reflexes for old Tonto here. Shooting. Ooh. That'll hit a 16 for three damage. 
that will take out Johnny D. Couldn't handle the power of the gush. Don't gush on you. Oh, I didn't like how that sounded. Never mind. I'm going to stop saying that. Uh, and now we're going to have the Lich shoot Miss Scarlet with some souls or something. Yeah, it's an 18 for two mm-hmm. whole damage. She is she is out of there. Both of my Miss Scarlets. I, uh, I'm going to have to send a PM to good old Bink Von Binky here and let him know Red yeah. Harrington is not as good as he Tell claims. Tell him what for. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Well, that is that is my turn. Those are my two figures that I've got going on. All right. Quadruple. Taking a shot. Need a crit hit. No. That'll mm. be 15s, though. Amigos doing the same thing. That'll be even worse. A 13. Mm. Uh, let's move Tad to here. And let's charge with a good old combination, I believe, Blades Exploit with Tonto here. Saving my good roll for mm, last. Okay, this could, this could be bad. A 16? Ah, uh, 16 will just miss by one. Uh, that is that is all I can do this turn. All right. That means it's time for Tidehunter. He going to gush you! Hit you with the gush, sharpshooter. But bam! Oh yikes! That that'll hit a thirteen. No gush, no gush this turn. We'll clear, clear the lich. Jack with sparrow hat will live through this, through the gush. Shoot. Um. <laughs> let's see. Oh, I don't think my chances are getting any better, so we'll have the outlaws mm. attempt to crit hit again. We'll go with the top one. No, that's a 15. Mm, not quite, no. Bottom one. A 16. Oh, Ooh, okay, again, on. not quite, sadly. Uh, yeah, you accidentally did. You're all right. Both will miss. <laughs> We'll have Jack with Sparrow Hat attempt to Blades Exploit. That's a 16. Oh, like, that'll once again miss by one. Getting very lucky here. And the... The with a massive range of five. Let's see where he can see to. Oh, what's this? <laughs> you got to be kidding me. He of course. will shoot the Of course lich. they can. Of course. For a crit hit. Of course he can. Uh, 13. Okay. Um, uh, no, it's not quite. We will we will clear quadruple. And that is my turn. All right. The Lich, having that amazing six speed, will now move to there. I'm going to clear Tide Hunter, so that way next turn he can gush. But it's your go, Simeon. All it's right. Your go. Quadruple, shooting at the Lich. Uh, eight, attack. I need some high numbers. That's a fifteen. Mm. The not quite. He's got a sixteen. You got to roll an eight. Also shooting Real damage to the Lich. That'll hit a 16. Ah! That will actually for, hit. For That'll one bring damage the lid down to click two. Plus an action token. And uh, oh, That's right. That's right. I will clear the rest of the quadruple amigos. And I will clear the last Tonto. The last of the Tontos. Hmm. Hmm. It's time for Tide Hunter. To gush! He's nine to Tonto something. Ah, that'll hit a 16. Uh, for three? Yeah. You want to theme prod that, Simeon? You want to try to oh, stay yeah. alive? I, I do, actually, yeah. I'll use, I'll use Yeah, I kind of forgot about those. I have two left. 
So All right, use, so I have one left. I'll have one left after. You have this. one left. Now I used the theme prop earlier. Use the theme. You used one theme prop earlier. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Gush. Second reroll. Oh, oh okay. baby. We'll That's use, some good gush. <laughs> we'll use my last one. Doesn't really matter who it comes from, but we'll have amigos here. Ah, uh, they Do don't it. have any keywords. They can't. Oh, that's can right. They, yeah, can they yeah. theme prom? Yeah, that's so sound right. yeah, without sound Tonto, right. I won't be able to use him anyhow. So yeah. Well, you only take you only take three damage, so you got to click five. Yeah. So Tonto is still alive, I believe. Enhancement. Yeah. So suddenly, all of my amigos can do two damage at range. Oh, ow! That's that's not actually too bad. I mean, if I move, it's not bad at all. All of yeah. I mean, you might be able to do a little firing line on the lich, potentially. It's potential, but it's your go, Simeon. It's your go. All right, Tonto's an eight for one, so there's no reason for him to stay around. He's gonna try and break away. Ouch. Hmm. Let's see here. A five will do it. He's gonna. Oh, he's, he's got it. To right here. Quadruple. It's gonna attempt to shoot the lich. Eight for two now. That'll hit a mm, 12. The Lich is what? 16 still. Ah, uh, uh, that will miss. Luckily, that will miss. We'll have Amigos here. Uh, let's see. It's not really great positioning. He will just attempt to shoot at Tidehunter. Okay. Need, needs a crit hit. Fourteen, and then mm, let's not see, quite. That, that was Amigos and Tad will now attempt the same shot. That'll be a fifteen. So no, no bueno on any mm. of those attacks. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Clear the not quite. No, not quite. And that'll be my turn. All right, the witch doctor. Gonna move like so, and then. Tide Hunter, the Lich Doctor. We'll move the Lich. Sorry, <laughs> the lich I get doctor. Witch Doctor and Lich mixed in my mind. Witch Doctor wasn't even on this team. He's probably like the greatest figure in this entire set. I just decided not to play him, but whatever. Send me an answer. Go. All right. Uh, let's see here. We've got three possible attacks we can make. I could try and reposition. Might as well, since I've only got four actions I can possibly take at all. Let's see. We've got a clear line there. Uh, kind of squeaky line there. And then that's going to be a punch either way. So we will attempt to break away the last Tonto. He will stay put. And we will have oh, baby. Tad and Amigos both take shots at the Tide Hunter. Needing some crit hits here. An 8. That'll hit a 16, which won't do anything. And a second attack from Amigos. That's an 11. That's getting close there. Definitely giving you some action tokens that don't do anything. And finally... The only it would. character it would on my team that can deal damage this turn, uh, the will attempt to punch the Lich. Does a 16 hit? Oh, it needs an 8. Oh. oh, he gets it. Lich will go to go to click 3. Yeah. <laughs> and I will clear quadruple. That is all I can do this turn. All right. Well... Only because, and I, as much as I like Gush as anybody, kind of don't want to try to cosplay Tide Hunter. <laughs> so we're going to have the Lich go for it against Tonto. Nine attack. We need a six to hit old Tonto here. Ooh, that'll hit. See if he makes his super, super senses, senses roll. I haven't made any yet, but I've been great on blades. So if I could just. Nope, not uh, he is he is one guy. Oh well, there it is. 
Ladies and gentlemen, the Lich. Today's hey. today's game winner. Hey, I still have figures the Lich. on the board. No, they're bystanders. They don't count. They, they cost the money. It's over. It's over. They, they, they cost points. No, they don't. They don't count. No, they're bystanders. They don't count. Is that? Are you? Are I, you serious? I'm pretty know. sure bystanders don't count. I don't know what the new. I'm pretty sure once. Yeah, no, I'm pretty. I'm thinking so. I think it's over, Simeon. I think when there's bystanders left, mm. there's no like. Are you yeah. telling me? Anyway, no so way I'm to just gonna back. say needing crit hits the entire time is that what you're saying <laughs> you have one damage yeah basically mm. basically simeon and saying that i'll say another epic golden age brawls come to a close reminder you can vote for what figures you use on our teams on facebook twitter discord in the comment section of this video next week i'm going to build from the desolation of smog and simeon is building from mage knight resurrection really cool guys if you want to see more videos like this on the channel feel free to like comment subscribe those all help us out a lot share the video with your friends if you want to see uh new rules being played and all that cool jazz and if you want to support the show monetarily which is the greatest way truly is uh you can do so patreon.com link in the description below uh, as always when it's roll 20 our tokens are provided by brad broyles you can check out his discord server if you message him on Facebook or something, Discord's kind of weird. I can't get a permanent link to it. I'm sure if I asked, I probably could. But yeah, if you want some more Roll20 tokens, like these beautiful Roll20 tokens, look at this man. Truly a face only a mother could love. Uh, you can do so. Check him out at Brad Broyles, guys. Thank you so much for watching. As always, happy trails. <laughs>